and happy welcome to today's video on the battle at the holy mountain between server 57 and 34. So as you see we are already in the middle of it and this battle is going to last a few hours. So here pretty much let's look around. The towers are occupied by MSDA. Let's first have a look. I just teleported, so I have to see where we are, what we're gonna do, and of course, I want to see who's in that tower and how strong they are. I'm gonna scout here too, just to get some stats. Okay, and here. I always like to do that so I see who's there and how we could arrange something. So let's see, we are up here, okay, so I'm gonna join, let's first look, okay. Okay, so I am gonna send because I'm already there this dragon I mean right now it's about the defense okay already full so I can't do it then let's check again all right I'm up here and I chose Windstrider because this one is really good to kill the opponent's art um archers just my Windstrider isn't fully upgraded, but it will be upgraded time by time. So let's check this. Okay. Uh -huh. As we see, we see what we see there. Not too. Okay. So now is gonna go for the middle because. As we saw, where is it? Let me check it. Okay, well, we will see if we can get the center or not. So who's there? Let's see. Uh, okay, so they're gonna take this Prevavli Tower. Hmm. So during this battle, you will always get some mails, and it's always pretty good to check it because you definitely see points and what's going on. So I recommend to look at it. And this means we're gonna be attacked. So let's have a look. What is happening? Ah, Christina's coming. Mm. <laughs> so, oh no, at G7, absolutely, she's pretty tough. So we will see what's going to happen. And the also beautiful thing about this is on Discord, we have the Land of Empire group. And we are all connected. So I do remember that Christine is also on Discord. And I will check it out later on if it's true. Or if my memory plays some tricks with me. So let's go over here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's check that. So for I already can say... That this battle is gonna be tough. Oh, I didn't want to go in there. Let's look. Ah, uh, still, my hospital is still empty, but I'm gonna hide some troops because I don't wanna lose all of my soldiers. So I'm gonna take them. 
the most important ones in my eyes. And I'm going to put them in there for 8 hours. So perfect. They are safe. Even if I get attacked on my city, nothing will do anything to them. But so far, also, what we agreed on before having the battle at the Holy Mountain was that there won't be any direct attacks on any cities, which I really like because then it's a lot more like a fair play. And at the Holy Mountains, it's mainly about the towers and, of course, the wonderful center. And not about attacking castles directly. So, I really like that. But we will see if everybody is going to hold to the promise. Because some players sometimes forget about the agreement or didn't read about the agreement or whatever their reason maybe so okay some already came back to my city let's have a look okay a new one starts mm. And as you see, pretty much on the top, here it takes a long time for people marching. Of course, you can use speed ups and such, but especially here in the center, the developers have made that setting that marching is almost like being a snail. So, let's see what we're going to do. So, they're all coming back. Sometimes I'm always just checking how my battery <laughs> status is. Because, as we all know, batteries love to turn off pretty fast. Especially if we're focused on something. So, okay. One more member is coming. And let's have a look at that. Oh, wow. Let's check it. Okay, so here you can see how many were in it. Uh-huh, okay. So Marlene is pretty, pretty strong. And one of the greatest players ever. And if... As you see, I'm checking right now how many T11 troops they have. And they have a bunch. And let's see. Here's G6. Okay, well. Um, okay, as we see here. Got your G7 is T11. So, I mean, these numbers, they pretty much say a lot why we weren't successful. Here you can see that too. The strength was totally different. And I also love to write to my team members. So, awa means pretty much, ouch. <laughs> so, yeah, there was G7. S T eleven and that's pretty pretty strong. And here I'm saying that it hurts. So okay, helped my team members, and now let's have a look at the mail. What we got? That was the beautiful hit. Okay. Now let's check how many troops I have in here. Boy, already 76 hours of healing. What I'm going to do now is to heal them step by step. Since so many people are online, it should work pretty good without using any speed ups. I mean, I still have enough troops. So let's 
look what's happening over here. Okay, so we're being attacked over there. We will see if we can hold her or not. Ah, uh, so this one is unoccupied. I wonder why, because they're not yet on any cooldown. Maybe I think they're waiting for us to enter so they can pretty much attack us there as soon as we go in it. Just gonna let my team members know. So, we will see. So here I'm saying, I mean, that the attack also hurt me because my troops are injured. <laughs> I mean, it's obvious. They're so strong compared to me, even if I were reinforced or being reinforced, it won't really do much. So let's do something. I'm gonna do that and I will choose... What's happening? Okay, some team members, they also like to open a rally to a Hell Watcher starting in five hours to place troops there so they won't get hurt. This is actually a pretty good trick. Just in case somebody really attacks you directly, all of your important troops are at the Hellwatcher rally, so you won't lose them. So let's look around. I forgot to activate some boosters. Oh, 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 okay, let's go down there. You can see how much I have. And let's activate them. That will help. But against such a strong opponent, it sure won't save me, but it's better than being without any boosters. So let's go up here again. Okay, we're being scouted. So they are okay now we will see we will see so christine is on her way to reinforce this tower mm. Okay, let's see if the report if he shares it or not. We will see. So, and as you see on the top left, I already lost around 3 million on power. And it's going to be more. Okay, so now we are being attacked. Oh, Kantoro is strong. Super, super strong. So... I predict that he will throw us out. I mean, we will see, right? And we'll, you'll see, that was pretty much obvious. I mean, look, they even have a pretty good Titano skill, a lot higher than ours. Our Titanos were so bad. 
so let's see you can see here they have a lot many wind striders and wind strider is a must have here and the more wind striders you have the better it is why because like i said earlier and already in another video where i was um showing you one of the best dragons to have um is that wind strider is directly attacking the archers which is so important and it also gives a boost for that and as just remember the movie lord of the rings if you see uh, the battles you always can watch how the archers in the back are so important because this is the thing where your opponents are being killed very fast and these are the first ones. I mean, if a sparrow flies and hits the opponent, either it's super injured or already killed before the infantry or the cavalry even reached them. So keep that in mind. So, okay, so as we see, Christine has started a rally and Kentoro is entering with a bunch more. And um, let's have a look around. I mean, as you see, it's a tough battle. So Hattori enter enters, R.I.P. enters, and the skin, as you see here, the purple golden one i wanted to have that too but you had to purchase hundred thousand diamonds and that's a lot i think it's over um 100 euros you would have to spend to get that skin and i didn't make it in time however it's no problem i just really like the skin and it's fancy because and yeah, well, it's fancy because it looks cool, right? And this one, look at that. Shadow Shifter also has such a cool skin. It looks cute. I mean, look at that one. Look at this hopping. I think it was who? Oh, sorry, it wasn't Shadow Shifter. I take it back. It looked like it. So. Okay, he's speeding up Noble to go in here. And let's look at the troops. Let's look at it. One, This is a really good tactic because he won't lose troops. Plus, we will definitely gain points. I'm going to follow him. Oh. <clears throat> and here it really doesn't matter what titanio I'm using and actually I could have used another um, set of heroes but at this point it really doesn't matter so let's look around okay looks good mm. So in SOC, on our castle, it doesn't stand invader, attack target on it. Because during the confluence battle, the server 34 gained so many points that the battle by the holy mountain is on our server. Because they had a lot more points in total of the whole week, which we didn't have. So this even is also pretty important. Not also because of the points, but also you can interact 
with other servers and you can talk, you can have really nice conversations if the others have a wonderful mindset too. And um, like I said before, you even can connect on Discord, which is awesome. So, this being said, keep it in mind, Land of Empires Immortal is so much fun to play. And as you see now on the top left, I also forgot to say that. Now my power even went a lot more down at the attack we had before. So now I lost around 6 million power. It's not that bad. And I also upgraded my hospital to G2. So a lot more troops can fit in. I heard that a lot of players being a G, which means being on a glorious level, never ever upgraded their hospital. But believe me, this is a really good trick. So that the troops being killed don't land in the hall of failure. Because if they're in there, in my eyes, it takes forever to get it back. And if your hall of valor is full, all of the other troops are lost. Right, so Noble is definitely right. We won't be successful in that rally. And so often I'm mistyping. Right, we have no chance to win, that's for sure. Mm, let's look over here. So I definitely won't join his rally because... I mean, come on, look at that. So many from server 34 are in it. And if you are now joining his rally, since he is a pretty weak player, you will definitely lose. If you wanted to march in, you have to definitely set up the strongest one of your alliance with the best combination of Titanios and the strongest heroes with the best skills you can use and of course the top troops you have the higher level troops you have I mean so let's have a look right so I haven't seen any free one yet so even somebody joined him, it is a definitely an attack to lose all of your troops. However, if he thinks he's going to be successful, good luck to him. So let's change it. Um, I'm gonna... What am I gonna do now? Oh, it's already full. I was too slow. Ah. Uh, Okay, whatever. Okay, they have two, we have four. Yeah, but I mean, there's no free one. And right, I haven't been in any tower. I mean, private light tower yet. So they're in here. They are, let's just look around. Actually, I could do a lot more easier, but why should I? I like to click so I can see. So it looks like she's weak for now, but it doesn't really say a lot because I mean, just imagine her hall of failure could be full or even her hospital could be full. So that definitely decreases her power, but it doesn't matter. I still think she's strong. Because as we already saw before, she poo, knows how to play and her teammates are very strong too. As you see, we do not have any G7. The highest we have is a G6 and that's it. 2G6 is now here Marlini and Erebus. 
So here that one. Okay, here you can see an overview. Blue are we, server 57, and the red ones are server 34. And I think this is going to be a constant switch and battle. So they are here waiting in a row. Pretty friendly because he's not being attacked. So let's look over here. I want one too. Okay, there's nobody, so I think I'm going to teleport. Yep. Let's go over here so my soldiers won't take forever to walk in. And let's close it and let's open it again because the game has a bug where I can't see anything. Let's wait. Now I'm telling my team members that I had to go half of the game because now no single tower was being displayed. And because she's in it, that I probably can enter it after her. So ATL is now here too. So I think I'm going to go up here because it didn't work before. <laughs> here you see the conference battle chat is also really nice. You can look what's going on, who's talking. And here already a lot. So many players love the Prep of Light number 9 because it has really good rewards in it. But since the competition is so high, I won't go there. I will stay here at number 1 so far. And I hope I can enter it because I also need some shards. These are these um, yellow looking puzzle items you need to upgrade your heroes so let's look around there's a lot going on as you see absolutely not boring what speed did somebody speed up i don't know what he means so let's look around over here Okay, so we still don't have that tower, and they have that. We're now down here. And look. Mm -hmm. And what I also really like during such events is to see the funny names people choose. I remember at the very beginning, I didn't know how to call my name. And Lord was already standing there. So I still have that in my name. Happy Lord of Peace. Okay, so she's in here, he's in there, he's in there. And this one is where I'm waiting for. So this is right now pretty balanced with the Breath of Light. And again, I like to check if somebody wrote something new. So I choose to take... What am I doing? Wait. Um, 
I'm gonna take very, very little troops, just 100. Because, I mean, look at my power and look at their power. Take and hit me so fast out of it and I don't want to lose so many troops. So I'm sending just 100 G10 in it. And here you also get the rewards for being inside of the towers before and that are not the best rewards but still you need it so here you can see i can stay now in here for 20 minutes and we will see how long i can hold the tower and who will come to attack me and when i hope it's gonna happen in a bunch of time because like i said i need those shards So now I'm just staying here, not doing much, waiting on the beautiful sun to shine down. <laughs> oh, as you see now, as I said, it it didn't take long, three minutes I could be in it. And Yingzi is now going to attack me, but the good thing about this is he won't gain a lot of points because remember, I only have a hundred troops in it. He's in there in four seconds, but I don't go out, I mean, for what, you know. I stay in there and let's got him because I want to see his troops. I always love to check the troops from others because like this I can learn. Okay. So actually, I think if I would have put all of my strong troops in there with um, chaos, I probably could have defended the tower, but I never know who's there, so just let me try something. I want to see if it works. Um, I'm going to choose Chaos. Oh, okay, I, my infantry is still G3 and not G4, however, let's do it like that. Probably not the greatest idea, but I want to see what happens. And look at this beautiful, nice dragon. I love it. And will it work or not? We will see. Maybe I should have chosen Windstrider. I think I'm going to regret it. We will see. We will see. And, so, uh, yep, I didn't make it. But that's okay. I mean, my chaos here is now at level 60. And I think his Odin was 110 or was it 120? So actually, it's a baby against a teenager. Oh well, what can you do? I tried it. So I guess for now it means to wait. Maybe he will go out soon so I can go back in. Because I need those. Let's look at it. Yep, his mighty tennis skill is zero, so it didn't do anything. So, this being said, I have to upgrade Chaos. I mean, if you watch the video about Vince Strider versus Chaos in my Land of Empire playlist. You will see how strong Chaos is at level 200. And you can predict or let's say imagine how much stronger Chaos will be if all of his skills are completely maxed out. So I'm joining them. Oh, and he's now here too. 
However, it's a battle. And that's totally fine. So as you see her here, it is super important to upgrade your Titanios because their skills are really important for the battle. And also the skills the Titanio has. And on top of that, like I mentioned before, you also have to choose the red dragons. Now let's imagine if you only choose now the red dragons, it's one of the worst things you can do because this dragon is the one we all get at the beginning of our game when we start playing Land of Empires. And it's good, you know, at the start, but in such cases, it's absolutely no good. And even in BOD, it's absolutely you no know, good to just have this dragon. But it's still better than nothing. Let's look around. So now we have a few more towers than they do. And why did he go in to go back out? Is he waiting for me to go back in? I think he's just collecting troops. So let's heal them. Oh wow, 171 already in hospital. That's okay, I'm healing him step by step because now you see my power is a lot more down. So let's have a look at the center. MSTA is still in it. And we are now walking to the tower down there. And as you see, the battle here can last a long time. I think uh, I'm total now for seven hours. And I'm again being attacked. Oh, wonderful. But I don't care now. Let's see. Oh, it's down here. That's where we're going. So we will see if we're going to make it or not. I definitely made a mistake in um, not going in with more troops. Well, we will see. At least when Strata is in it. Oh, okay. We are in. Let's see. Attack countdown is now for 3 minutes and 25 seconds. Which means we have to hold it. Come on. And. We will see. So actually right now I would love to see the battle. And we won. Look around. So we have our Titanic skills a lot higher this time. And they have a few very little people in it. Okay, you see my not the best, but So we have Sage to Holy Mountainous, it's just sad. Okay, we're in here. And ATL is right now in it. They threw them out. And we chose not to attack. I don't know why, but that's just how it is. <clears throat> Let's have a look. Okay. So here we see more details on which trips they Send in it. Okay. Hmm, what was their plan to do that? That's not interesting, right? But they, I think they should have put a lot more wind striders in it. Especially if you want to hold the middle. So let's ask my teammates. Should we try to get to... The holy middle. And as you see, so often making time mistakes because I have the feeling that in this game, my typing is so horrible, but outside it's a lot better. Who knows why? 
so oh no I don't want to do that what's happening okay so he's still in here there we have that down there and you see a lot more players from server 34 have joined and in Amman there are a lot more players than we are so far I mean from server 57 there are not so many in here but now we almost have every single private flight and I'm gonna go in here now let's check it and of course I'm just gonna send some baby troops in it ah oh, what happened okay wait I'm gonna do that really doesn't matter now and I'm gonna speed up because why not oh I clicked wrong I wanted to speed up whatever let's try it again and first let's have a look over here what's going on okay so there's so much happening they're rallying and I think also hiding some of the troops well going to the um, hell watchers or even attacking other cities on our server okay no answer I love it I really really love it when my messages are being ignored it happens so often that they love to ignore messages from fellow players who knows why I don't think it's very nice but it's their decision I mean I know they're online but you know right <laughs> that's how it is because I was actually hoping that some of the R4 or even the R5 would answer but as usually it's not being done so let's look oh no single private flight is occupied that's okay because after a certain time um which is happening right now the prep of slides are charging and it takes as you see here now four minutes and a bunch of seconds and i think in total it's five minutes so you also have to wait on that cooldown so here we see the cooldown is almost over and i'm gonna enter it i think this is now a good chance since it just started that I can finally collect some shards. We all need shards. Just one soldier because why not? And now speeding up should work. Yep, yep, yep. It costs 2000 diamonds, but that's fine. Since you're participating in a lot of events, you also get a bunch of diamonds. And if you purchase a discount pack like for example I did with Chaos you also get a bunch of diamonds so that's so helpful so okay I'm now in it cross your fingers that I'm lucky now but I guess <laughs> the same dude is gonna be after me it's sure gonna be the same one Okay, so let's look around. So MSTA has the center back again, and I want to see who's in it. And let's look over here. Okay, we have that tower. Some more seconds, and then... I mean, it's a tech countdown for the last of the seconds. Let's look over here. I just want to check their power. Okay, Hattori. So it's not the same dude, but it's Hattori. I think Hattori, um, I've met him a bunch of months ago. I think it was even the first or second BOD um, where he was in the Alliance. And he has some more accounts called Hattori 1 or 5, I forgot. So that's also very cool that you meet 
fellow players in other events again. So what's happening? So as you see, it takes around one minute until he arrives. And again, the game has a bug. Oh, that's okay. Okay, I got six shards. Yay, I got six. That is so good. I love those. And I could use a lot more. <laughs> Whatever. I stay in here because pff, just one soldier is in it. So no big loss. If I would know that I would have a chance to win, I would put a lot more soldiers in it, but forget it. Oh, look at Lord A01. He is making a rally in the Holy Mountain. That's again a player who has no idea and never ever talks to anybody. So actually, honestly, I don't even remember him at all. Whatever. The ones who are joining his rally will commit suicide. I mean, don't get this wrong. I mean, the troops he's sending in it are going to be killed. I don't get what he means. Whatever. So I'm entering again. Ah, Yingxi, of course. He will come back. I know he will attack me, but that's okay. So it's almost balanced. So two more towers that are free. And as you see, the number nine is always occupied. Always, always, always. And very seldom not occupied. Here you see a Tori. I like, look, okay, he's a G6. Great. Okay, looks really good. And his Chitano skill is okay too. So here it is. I have to write it now. Look at their strength before opening a rally to attack. But he won't read it. Whatever. I had to write it. So let's look around. Yeah, right. So you see, even novel it has the same opinion like I do. But he's gonna ignore it. Someone scouted. That's okay. Huh, I wasn't too fast enough to look who scouted, but it's okay. Then was somebody very close to the tower. Okay, awesome. Marlene canceled the rally. Very, very good. So, of course, I go back to heal them, little by little, because as we all know, in the upcoming week, BOD will start, which means having a full hospital constantly. So, the timing couldn't be better to have a holy mountain right before BOD starts. And I assume, since it's been happening in the last few times, that during BOD, even the battle at the Lost Shrine will happen. I'm so sure that it's going to be on Sunday. So we will see. I'm going to keep you updated. And of course, this video will be posted later. Since it's a very long video. Which means it takes a long time for rendering and a long time to upload. So... 
So let's look around. Okay. NVO is here. I can't believe it. They're actually never there. So why is he not entering? I mean, he went out, so he can go back in. So yeah, I'm pretty surprised that they're here because I haven't ever seen them before. They are now the third best alliance on server 57. So I'm gonna hit him up directly. Because I'm not sure if he knows how to play. So I tell him, hi, go into tower. I hope he's gonna answer because he needs those shards too. Oh, okay, he wasn't fast enough. Who's coming? Oh, okay, that dude. He was named before Garvel and I could pronounce it much better. Now I have no idea how to pronounce Stormf Chromf. No idea. I can't pronounce his new name. So... I'm still in here. Thank you, Yingxi. Scouting. Okay, no problem. So here, you see. Oh my gosh. Server 34 is so active. So many players. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. What does it mean, even though your smiles are common battle? Right, so I do have to tell them that I haven't ever seen them before. And it doesn't look to me that I even know how to play the Holy Mountain. I mean, you, you don't get anything for just sitting there. So Christine is now there. So, okay, I experienced that the in-game translator for some languages just don't work. So I'm giving him now advice how he can gain some points without losing too much. I mean, I, I really like to help and they have to know how to play the Holy Mountain. So as you see, it's so much fun to make friends with others, to help each other, and this really makes a wonderful community. So what's happening now here? Let's look around. So let's encourage him some more. Oh, I made a typing mistake. So this means the translator will mess it up for him. Again, I think I'm going to rewrite it. Oh, you see, oh, so many wonderful typing mistakes. I love it. It's one of my favorite parts about this game. Whatever, that happens. So I'm still in here. Thank you very much. Let's see what he wants. It's in the main tower. What's in the main tower? Let's ask him. Or... Where? I mean, he's not in the main tower. Come on. MSDA is in the main tower because for me, the main tower is the, the center. That one is the main tower. There's not NBO in it. You see, Lord won't learn it either, but I'm tired to always say the same thing. So I'm not bothered about that.
but it's pretty funny. So yeah, he absolutely doesn't understand it at all. Well, some people, they don't even read the rules because every alliance can, you know, write down some rules and everybody can see it and reread it whenever they want to. So let's have a look over here. Okay. So nobody really writing more. Okay, fine. Yeah, so I do have to say that I don't even remember Lord. Lord, I don't even remember him. That's how it is. I don't. So here I'm saying I can't remember him. Never saw his name before. Not even at the altar or in any other even. No idea. So, okay. So Kingston moved away. No idea why. Maybe he went somewhere else. Okay, they're now up here. Well done. They're finally in a tower. Chapeau, chapeau. Yeah, Gera is so right. That's how it is. Okay, let's look. We are still here. So she says, I have no idea. Haha, <laughs> true. No idea. So now I'm saying we could be nice. If we join the next time in his rally with a few troops so he knows what how it is to open such a rally. Actually, I think I'm going to do it one time. Put one soldier there so that he finally gets it and he has no chance. So I hear you. There's a wonderful um, example that the translator doesn't work. Makes no sense to me, but okay. I'm sure he doesn't want to say that. But that's fine. So let's have a look at our candle. Okay, it's, mm, we have now a lot more there than them. So three for the server 34 and we have the rest. Let's scout. I want to see what's happening now. So you see, it makes no sense. What did they already give? Gave, no idea. So whatever he's thinking, I'm gonna tell him that I don't mean them. Because I was talking about that Lord's A O one something. Probably he means that. They got hit. Well, yeah, that hurts. It really does. Losing seven million pals hurts, but better than losing more. So again, I'm going to heal just a little bit. I should actually go in here more often, but I want to look around and such. What's going on? What I can do? And if my troops are still in here or if they're being kicked out of the Breath of Light Tower.
So we see MCA is really tough. They keep on holding the middle. And Christine, oh, thank you. I've been missing you so much. Come on in and kill my one troop. That soldier is going to cry in the hospital being so lonely. If it would have been an empty hospital, but it's not. So I let her attack because I won't lose much. Yeah, so no need to run, that's for sure. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm saying no need to run. I mean, I'm not running either because why should I? But this is now more sarcastic because I'm like, yeah, no need to run because y'all keep on attacking. That's true. They keep on attacking the towers. So you can't really stay in it. So she went back out. I'm gonna go back in with baby troops. Fine for me. I'm sure she thinks I'm fooling her, but I don't want to have too many in the hospital because of BOD. I don't want to risk it. Look at her. She's six. Really good. So this means that she's a new G7. Takes a while because you need a lot of sand to upgrade your. Cavalry and your infantry and a wonderful bow, bow, bow soldiers. And let's call them bow, bow soldiers because I hate the name archers. I can't really pronounce it. It gets on my nerves. So let's call them bow tie. New name for it. Bow tie soldiers. And you know who I mean. Bow tie soldiers. Breath of light number nine. This one is free. I'm going to tell him because... The one that he gets a lot of rewards since they're new in my eyes at the battle. Unless they were there and never saw them, but it's fine. Oh, Reina Margo is now here, but nobody's in it. Just go in there, it's fine. I would go in it, but I cannot enter another one. So this is also a rule here at the holy mountain that you can only occupy one tower at the same time and not two okay christine is now leaving private light number five which means she left wow i didn't even notice that that she went away from me it was so cozy beside her but that's fine let's look so, NBO should go back in. Come on. I'm out of it, so let's go back in. But I can tell him to go in there too. And this one, but I think either they're not online, I don't want to talk anymore. Or they're done. So now they have more towers than we do. Okay, so Kingston is not answering anymore. Okay, no problem. Let's look at that. Okay, this is here. Oh, again, a bug. I don't see anything again. This happens so often. I think I probably have to reset the game, close it and open it. But first, let's do this again.
Okay, it's back, so I don't have to go out. Look over here, so many. Lonely Wolf, oh, cute name. He-Man, aha, uh -huh. okay, He-Man. Lazy Ranger, oh, I love that name, Lazy Ranger. This reminds me of the Power Rangers, oh my god. Such a cute childhood memory. Okay, and here you can see they are also hiding the troops in Hellwatchers Rally. Always do that, always. Even if you made an NAP with another alliance, you never know if somebody does attack. Wooshy, oh cute. Castle Grey Skull. Yeah, here, Hattori 3. I knew it. So, I want to... Okay, no messages were being saved. Because I remember that I was texting with a Hattori in BOD. Okay, now we're back. My game crashed. I mean, the recording crashed and I couldn't show you what's going on. So, now I am down here. Oh, somebody used speed ups while I was walking in it. <laughs> oh, it was free, but it's okay. I'm always sending baby troops. See, here's Hattori. So, yeah, Fred Hattori 3. And then I also think he has Hattori 5. So, now look around here. Let's look here. Why did. La Lon D attacked the Holy Mountain. Again, a player who has no idea who, how it works. La Lon D is a weak player. Uh-uh, you have no chance to. I mean, come on. Some players have to use common sense. For real. But it's okay. Probably they are hobbyists in healing troops so that's fine okay so i'm in here now and um or no wait have wait wait let's go in here help him speeding up his troops i'm not he's in it no i'm in it okay i'm in it sorry um he can go in afterward. Oh, again, this book. Here, now, okay. Let's look around because I don't think I'm here. So this is free. I'm going to go there with speed ups. Or not, I will see. Probably I will because I'm not in the other one yet. Let's look. One troop. Yay. One troop of this one. And one trip of that one. Okay, good. Since this one is occupied, we're at Hillebird 2. So it's okay. And let's use some speed ups because pff, it takes too long and for my taste. I want to be in it. So yeah, you see the beautiful wind strider. I love this chicken. With gold, and as soon as it's more upgraded, it's white and gold. I love this color combination. So, Lord Guki, or how was it? Ah, Gokul, Lord Gokul. You see, there are so many people over there. Where did we go? Okay, so now they're over here. And a lot from my fellow team members are not here anymore I mean you see it takes a long time and I think I'm gonna go too because it lasts forever stay tuned for more and I'm gonna do the same with BOD thanks for watching like and subscribe this was your happy lord of peace and land of empires join the game to play with me in the link down below